the area of a rectangle is represented by x squared minus 5x minus 24. That's the area. And they say that the width is represented by x minus 8. x minus 8 equals the width. So express the length um, of the rectangle as a binomial. Remember, a binomial means two terms. So they're saying to you that they want you to factor this area right and one of the factors they tell you already is going to be x minus 8 and the other factor should be the length right because width times length is area so the two factors multiplied to get the area represent the width and the length so we have x squared minus 5x minus 24 with many of these basic quadratics your your go-to approach is to look at this number here and find factors of the c term this is the c term the last final number and see what factors add up to the b term right here. So in our case, c equals negative 24, and b equals negative 5. So we need factors of negative 24 that add to negative 5. Except they're giving us one already. x minus 8 is the width. So that means minus 8 is one of the factors we're going to use. The other one, right, this number will always represent one of the factors we use here. The other number has got to be what? Well, if this is negative 8, the number, other number has to be positive 3 because x plus 3 is the other factor. And the idea is that negative 8 times positive 3 is negative 24, and negative 8 plus 3 is negative 5. So those two numbers satisfy the components um, for the factoring process here. And now we have the width and the length. And you could test it. If we redistribute this, you x times x, that's x squared. x times 3 is 3x negative 8 times x is negative 8x, and negative 8 times 3 is negative 24. That's why it has to multiply negative 24, right? These two numbers, eight, negative 8 and 3, when you multiply them, you get the c term. So then multiply negative 24. And these two numbers have to add to negative 5, because here when you simplify, you'll be adding them, and you get negative 5x. Right? So this does work. The answer for the length is right here, x plus 3.